YouTube, what's up, it's not there, and today I have another live gameplay commentary for you guys, and today I'm just going to do a normal domination. I had an idea to do a commentary basically talking about um, PAX Prime and the release of Merc from from Optic, but instead of, I had an idea, instead of doing that, I could just do a live commentary talking, talking about those two subjects, so... Um, if you don't know, PAX, PAX Prime is the tournament that's going on this weekend. Um, I didn't... I watched the first two days, but I didn't really watch much of Sunday. So, I'm not really 100% sure, like, how the teams are placing. I think I know... I think FaZe are doing really well. Uh, let me get B. This guy in this guy just quizzed me. This is why I hate snipers so much, man. But I think FaZe is doing well. But besides that, I don't really know that much. So basically, that event has been going on this weekend, and as you may know, the team Envious they've been doing really bad in the past few events, like really bad. So Jcap left the team. Basically, he left the team earlier today so he was a free agent and earlier earlier that day Merc was released from Optic now the first time like the first time I saw that I honestly had no idea why they would like drop him I was I was just like I didn't really know what to say honestly I don't know why they would drop him but at first I was, I wasn't really angry, I was just like, amazed that they would actually, actually drop him, and, and I just got no scope. But, they, ne they didn't really um, say why they dropped him, they just said it wasn't, an, uh, it wasn't about his skill, that's what they said. Now basically here's why I, why I think he left, or they dropped him, or whatever. He probably, um, it's been a rumor that he's getting married soon, that's why he left the team, he wants to focus on that. That may be true, and if that's the case, then I understand him completely. But, honestly, I just think that the team house isn't really his thing, and he wants to spend more time with, like, as I said, like, he wants to spend more time with his girlfriend and family, and stuff like that. That may be why he left. But... But anyway... I'm just getting melted, damn. But anyway, Jcap took Merc's place as an anchor. And... I kinda knew that they were gonna pick up an anchor, so... At first, I... I had in mind that they would probably get, um... Stainville from Sora. Because... He seems like a really cool chill guy. He's also an, an anchor. And yeah, I thought they were gonna get Stainville. So, that's what I thought. But then... But I kinda... I also knew that they might get a guy from Envy because... I kinda knew someone would leave from Envy because they keep... They keep losing and nobody wants to be on a team. That keeps losing. So, I... Um, I kinda knew somebody might leave from NP. And it's AMP City right here. We're being dominated. Go on the aggression. So I kinda knew somebody might leave from NP. But I know they they had to pick up an anchor player, so the the choices that they had was between like Jacob, Stainville, Clayster. And it's more it's more anchors, but that's the main that I can think of right now. So, now the Optic Gaming roster consists of Nesha, Scumpy, Big T, and Jcap. And Jcap, he was on Optic back in Black Ops 1 and Mon for 2, I believe. So that's pretty cool that he's back and hopefully they're gonna start winning some championship. But, I mean that's really cool for them. I'm pretty excited to see how they can play, the, play together. And yeah, that's basically what happened over the 
this weekend. So, yeah. I mean, let me go into blue because I'm about to get naded. And I'm almost on the streak. I'm about to get sniped from across the map. Alright. Good job, agents. Get ready for the next <sighs> I'm actually not doing completely completely terrible. But I'm doing pretty decent for talking while doing a lot of com. At first it's actually really hard, but you get used to it over the while. Like over it. When you do it a lot. But I'm almost at this beast set, so I'm like I'm like two kills away from this. Like a kill or two. So hopefully I don't choke Security this V, this orbital V set. Enemy has a now I can get my dogs secure. and my swarm, and this be a really good live commentary for you guys. Right. Uh, AMP is man. Securing B. The electromagnetic pulse grenades. I don't even know what to do. Okay, now I'm not AMP. I know it's people in blue. So I can't challenge that because it's gonna be some EMPs, man. <laughs> Enemy has B. Let me just challenge it. Be advised, hostile UAV incoming. They have a UAV. Oh God. Securing B. How many EMPs? I'm like a kill away from this visa. I cannot choke this. I'm just gonna keep going back to the base because I cannot choke this. If I choke this, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna punch the wall or something. No C4 City. Okay, I got it. Orbital V sat awaiting orders. We've lost the advantage. Okay, now I should have my dogs in swarm if I play this correctly. Too much people over there. He's done. Securing Bravo. AMP grenades for days, man. Eyes on enemy. Okay, unit on I got my dogs. I need. I'm pushed up way too far. <laughs> AMP city, man. This guy's about to blow up. I don't know how EMPs got so popular in in pubs. Securing Come on, you like one more kill for this. Be advised, hostile UAV incoming. Let me get this one kill. Thank you. Swarm awaiting orders. I can't, I can't even call it in because of the EMPs. I can't even call it in. Or as soon as I get on EMP, I'm gonna call this in. Alright. Friendly canine unit in your AO. I'm gonna try and get a double swarm. If I do if I do that, we're just gonna <laughs> be amazed. Ah oh, god. I'm so weak right now. We're gonna get B because we're gonna about to lose this game. I shouldn't get on this by myself, but my swarm should get my back. My doggies and swarm should get my back. Thanks, teammate, for getting on B with me. Yeah. Like I got to fucking destroy it. Let's get A too. Look at that triple cap. Securing A. Securing A. I'm going off on the main stage right now. Losing Bravo. I'm taking B. Losing Charlie. We lost oh, I didn't get A. Oh my god, that's the. Security. Biggest fail ever. I'm about to die if I get that again. Uh, <laughs> that's the biggest fail ever. They're gonna spawn behind me, probably. Friendly UAV inbound. That's the biggest fail ever. <laughs> oh my god. Losing B. They're taking B. Oh shit. Timeline in jeopardy. Pick it up. It's a minute left. Come on. Orbital 
The whole team is above me, in front of me. Stay still. This guy isn't playing in the back. At least let me get my dogs, at least. Too close. Fight harder. Just spotting back here. You're so weak. UAV inbound. No. Friendly counter UAV. Double dogs, at least. Double dogs. <laughs> no, let me get this kill. Double dogs. Hostile UAV above. Got a double swarm. <laughs> I got a double swarm. Friendly canine Oh my god. Swarm on standby. That was, that was the best live commentary I ever did in my life. I went 50 and 7. I got a double swarm. A double swarm. A double swarm. Oh my god. I went just went 50 and 7. I guess I'm just too good, man. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I went 50 and 7. Um, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos from me. And I will catch you guys later. Oh, flew.